Hello world, hello universe. Yes, good morning all the way from Barangay Ulian. There you go. All right, I hope you guys are having a good time and doing a great and a wonderful day wherever you are right now. Okay, I'm standing close to the bridge between Galas where I am standing close by and Barangay Ulingan of course. Yep, this is now the bridge. Well, before it's very narrow and now look at that. Wow. Okay. So this is it. What a wonderful day indeed. So here is now the area when you have to enter Barangay Ulingan. Yep, I'll gonna be touring you in just a while. And let's find out what's inside and what's new in our beloved Barangay. Well, what we welcome you is a self-service car and motor wash. You just have to drop 5 peso coin. Then you've got 3 minutes cleaning of your car and motor. It's a serene morning everyone. And Yes, I'm talking to you. <laughs> I'm standing in front of Uli and Barangay Hall. right? But this is no longer the usual barangay that you're seeing. Because in front, there's this ongoing construction of a covered court. Well, I guess this club court would uh, uh, capacitate about a hundred people. So when there's like a meeting or a convergence barangay assembly, for example, for the senior citizens of Barangay Ulinga, so this place would be just all right. Okay, so once again, uh, Barangay Ulinga, Barangay Hall. All right, let's take a look. We're back to the super highway. We have the hardware supply, and on my left again, Patrias Itri. So, tanang mga rural transit diha uban pa mga transient people diha sila mamahaw ka Patrias Itri. All right, so that's a super wide road we have here at Barangay Ulingan. Okay, so ongoing construction of buildings, especially kaniyang uh, building pohon gamiton gani siya ug rental because of this a huge construction we have now the East Medical Center all right so it's a hospital just uh, located or situated close to the Republic Sports Complex or that's East Medical Center Yes, I'm standing now here at the main gate of the Republic Sports Complex. And uh, there are like a lot of vehicles passing by. But at the very end of my back there, so that's the Ace Medical Center. Just beside Olingan Sports Complex. So that's how beautiful Barangay Olingan right now. Right? But at this point in time, bawal pa ang musulod sa sports complex. If you want to jog or uh, cycle around, dili pa because it's been turned into a quarantine area for the LIS. Yep. So dili ta makasulod sa karon. So we'll just have to stand by here outside. But I think uh, that's later part na when everything is okay. Uh, we're going to check out as well kung sa inaasulod sa sports complex. But for now. As you can see at my back guys, mauna diha ang ongoing construction sa ACE Medical Center. And take note, uh, mga construction improvements are running down south. And usa sa mga nabulahan ang atuang barangay sa Uingen. Yup. So daghan na kayo mga establishments na, na tindog dere as of this moment. So we're gonna be checking out kung sa uh, mahitabo ani ato ang gitawag na ACE Medical Center. But hopefully, in next year or two years from now, okay, completely na siyang uh, mahuman, then it can only already be occupied. Okay, so we'll get a uh, take close to that, and I'm gonna give you the latest update. 
Okay, here we go. The Zalinga Sports Complex. Right, the entrance and another one, a new, a new building. Well, we're going to building. Okay, so there you go. Good morning, Porok Morning Star. All right, here we go in Porok Morning Star. And on my right, I guess this is Villa Marie. All right, Function Hall at the same time. There are rooms for rent there. So just drop by Villa Marie. All right, so what a great morning shout out sa mga taga Morning Star. Diba? All right, my buntag ka na yung tanahan. Wherever you are, All right, it's Porok Morning Star. Okay, just want to say hi to their Porok president, Ma'am Annabelle Cabale. Okay, so there are like beautiful houses now constructed along the highway and uh, plenty of bodegas actually now, right, established in Olinga. And take note, this one here, your care pharmacy first ever in Olinga, so you don't need to go somewhere else. Tanana, na sila baligya, tanana. And uh, here we go, that's the road going to the Barangay Hill, and here is the Balutan. Okay, so you guys just drop by there if you want to eat balot. And on my left, as you can see on the, the building there, all right, there's a stall. So, for rent, po na siya. And of course, Nanay Evelyn's door is found there. Okay, so early morning, people do cleaning. It's past 6 already. And here we go. Here is the Olingan ice plant. So, for those hoarding ice, no worries with the ice. You have ice here plenty of ice and there you go that's another bodega so that's Ulinga now full of bodega and welcome good morning for rock central okay another building so there's a lot of building I guess on my right here's the Silas residence and the Bastasa not so great capture but the one there is the corporal residence and uh, of course we have the MLL here with their building okay so we have our motor shop on the right okay, motor shop, I, I usually drop there to fix my motor okay Lolo Duroy's place and of course the green gate we have Lola Monin's residence right? uh, hello my childhood memories are actually here <laughs> all right and the Talipapa Talipapa area is uh, where people sell a lot of commodities from fish, foods, and etc. Well, this is now Burok Central, well, like the heart of Barangay Olinga. So, as you can see, there are now plenty of stores around here. Yep. So, at my back actually is the portion of the Talipapa. Yo, they can buy your basic commodities there, mga vegetables, mga isda. But now, Murag wala by display because it's like very early why I did this early in the morning because like wala pa kayo mga sakyanan kaya yun na pit grabe na ang bulto sa sakyanan so it's difficult for me to capture moments pero hindi rin karoon okay slide pa alright so mo siya ang crossing padulong sa fisheries here this one and opposite to that is the crossing going to farmer center Yup, so that's Barca Olinga now. Alright, passing over the crossing. Here we go. Wow, that's a beautiful white house there. Of course, Mount Villarias is building over there. I think the gray one, I don't know what's going to happen, that, but it's ongoing. The construction is ongoing. And on the right, here we go. Of course, Olingan South Elementary School, I guess, a small, small school with a big heart. They're also situated along the highway. Shout out to all the teachers of Olingan South. Hello. All right. So speaking of building, another building on my left. All right. That's Olingan Water, Water Refilling Station. It's somewhere there. And going forward, you know, it's a little shaky because I'm on my bike. All right. So the green gate there, of course, Mom Liar. Okay, I remember Mom Liar was my grade one teacher before. And stalls from the Ukay Ukay. These people are still here last May during the fiesta of our beloved Saint, uh, patron saint, 
kay San Vicente and people did not remove their tents. So we're approaching now the chapel. All right, here we go. So for those who miss San Vicente Ferrer Chapel, here we are. Okay, so you might be missing the place. Newly painted, so that looks beautiful. Oh my God, car display is also in Olingen. All right, so if you want to buy a car, visit Olingen Display Center. This place now is Porok Sampagita. Okay, hello sa mga taga Porok Sampagita. Good morning to all of you. Okay. Wow, another bodega, I guess, on the left. That's another construction. A lot. All right, on my left, I guess it's a car wash and each muffler a provider or supplier. Okay, so moving to my right. Okay, that road is going to Laoy Ulingan Elementary School. All right, not yet cemented, but hopefully soon. All right, we're approaching now. Where? Okay, that's a bake shop and a barber shop to the last crossing. Here I come. I think uh, this is the last crossing for Barangay Ulingan. Okay, this road on my right that's going to relocation, going to Laoy. Okay, so we're here now uh, at the pedestrian. Next to that will be Binalabag, then Barangay Punta. Alright, so that's gonna be the end of our journey for now. Once again, Barangay Ulian, hello to the world.